This is a shuffle. This is a shuffle. Oh, this is a shuffle. And this is a shuffle. Hello, and welcome to the first episode proper of this new series, Leeds Harmonica, Harmonica Miscellanea. That doesn't sound great. Leads harmonica, harmonica, miscellaneous. Oh, whatever. Um, anyway, what is a shuffle? This is really important. This is fundamental to blues. It's a bedrock rhythm of blues. Okay. You'll have heard shuffles before. You've probably played them as well. Um, but you may not know how to identify one when you hear it. So, two levels to this. I'm going to do it very simply and sort of offer an intuitive uh, look at it. And then I'll sort of explain what's going on. So, very, very simply, a shuffle is a rhythm. Um, you can play it on any instrument. It's just a, it's, it's a pulse, right? And it goes like this. One, two, three, four, 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 one, two, three, four. A harmonica holds one, two, and three inhale, and one, two, three exhale twice. In, in, out, out. You feel that sway, that kind of swagger. That's what a shuffle is. Oh, even better, you could do one, two, three, inhale, holes one, two, three, inhale, is what I mean, obviously, and holes two, three, four, exhale. But the rhythm's the same, it's just that pa, 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 pa. And if you think about, um, I guess it's called a shuffle because it, it's kind of shambling, it's like shuffling along. And if you play this rhythm in your head when you're walking, it it kind of starts to make sense and that's a great way of starting to internalize it because you want to get to the point that this, uh, this d -d 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 is like the, uh, the background pulse to your life, right? This is going on in your head all the time. Um, you know, when you're waiting at traffic lights, you can sit there going da da da. Da, 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 da. When you're in the shower, when you're doing the washing up, um, when you're pretending to listen to someone who's talking to you, ba, 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 ba. have that because you really want to internalize this and you've got to make it yours. You've got to, you know, own it. Um, and that's a shuffle, right? That's the intuitive look. Ba, 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 ba. Uh, it's so important. It's so cool. Right. I'm going to briefly pause the video, then I'm going to do the slightly more complicated explanation. Okay, here's the science bit then. Um, all music has a beat, right? A pulse that goes on beneath the music, and it's steady, and it keeps the time. So, in blues, we're counting one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, okay? But what we're going to do is add things here, and build up to that shuffle rhythm. So instead of thinking about one, two, three, four, 
we're going to put in a triplet feel. And what that means is we get three notes for each beat. Okay, so that's like one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. Okay, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. Three little notes for each beat. Shuffle feels are great. Slow blues use them a lot. Um, but for the shuffle rhythm, we're going to remove the two. Okay, so instead of going, uh, what is it? One, two, three, one, two, three. We're just going to go one, three, one, three, one, three, one, three, one, three. Okay, so we're getting there now. That's nearly what it is. One, three, one, three, one, three. But the special source is in the timing, in the in the way that you present this. So we're going to slightly elongate one of the notes, basically. And it takes it from one, three, one, three, one, three, two, one, three, 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 one. So we're, we're slightly elongating the first beat, right? One, three, one, three, one, three, one. And that's our shuffle rhythm. One, three, one, three, one, three, one, three, one, three, one, three, one. Yeah, one, three, one, ba, ba, ba. and then we got the swagger back, ba, 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 and we're grooving. And um, you could get a little bit deeper into the theory if you wanted to, but um, that's what a, that's what a shuffle is, and they're they're absolutely everywhere. Um, and I just I do encourage you if you're trying to learn to play harmonica blues harmonica especially but even if you don't it's a good thing to do just to really internalize that bam, 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 bam. um in a slight i think i've talked about this before in a slightly hippie-ish way i sometimes tell people to imagine that 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 rhythm is just in the ether right it's just out there and you just jump on and off of it for a short time right it's like oh where are we here oh there's the shuffle Doom, bam, bam. All right, and just making that, being in charge of that, is uh, is super useful. It'll carry you a long way. Um, all right, that was episode number one. Tremendous. Um, I do hope that you continue to watch and subscribe and all that. And uh, if you're so minded, you can join my brand new Patreon where this where i'm gonna be talking i'm gonna be um talking about playing improvising against uh progressions that aren't your standard 12 bar blues so how do you do that all right i'm gonna do a short series of videos on that on the patreon so have fun thanks for watching i'll see you soon